Trinidad and Tobago has received confirmation of its first case of COVID-19 or coronavirus. It came at 2.45 this afternoon. Minister of Health Terence Dial Singh released the details from CAFA at an emergency press conference held on Thursday afternoon. Students writing the SEA exam. This year's exam was originally scheduled to take place on April 2, but was rescheduled as public health guidelines ordered schools closed to prevent the spread of COVID-19. Tobago has received confirmation of its first case of COVID-19 or coronavirus. It came at 2.45 this afternoon. Minister oh my goodness. What is going on in this world? What is going on in Trinidad? Why does this have to be happening to me when I'm about to write the biggest exam in my life? This is so unfair. Where is boy? No school, no exam? Looks like I am free. Not a chance. Sit down, let's get started. Come now, Daddy. When will the study in end? I'm so fed up of SEA exam. And after careful consideration and deliberation, it was decided that the SEA examination secondary entrance examination will be held on Thursday the 20th of August 2020. COVID robbed me of so many things. No primary school graduation, no fun going out after C exam, no celebration, no saying goodbye to my old school friends. It sucked. Oh, hi, Michael. We were waiting for you a long time. Why are you looking like you're so scared? Don't you know that you topped the school, boy? You want to see your results now? Yes, yes. What do you think you passed for, boy? Let's see. Oh, my goodness. Hillview College. You're surprised? Congratulations. Five minutes later. 
This is a tale about my first week of school. I passed with my first choice. Isn't that cool? Thought I'd walk through the open gates on the first day, but COVID-19 ruined all my hopes and dreams, I see. They say we're now meeting in Google Classroom. Whether it's sync or async, it all songs like do. Wish COVID will hurry and be done and over with. To start my real Hillview adventure, I'm sure it'd be lit. Maybe it's like something like that, something like this. And I've got my shades. So, in memorizing and then having that kind of thing, I'm going to be perfect. I'm going to be perfect. Where's where? Tim, do you know? Tim, do. Can you believe that I still haven't walked the walls of my own school yet? More like the walls of my house? This is so unbelievable, eh? Me is bad. A state of emergency has been implemented to control the wildfire spread of COVID-19 cases with its spiraling death toll that is sweeping across the country. Prime Minister Dr. Keith Rowley made the announcement at the Diplomatic Centre on Saturday. From midnight tonight, Trinidad and Tobago will be under a state of emergency involving a curfew that from then onwards would be 9 p.m. to 5 a.m. <coughs> <coughs> My name is Michael Roberts. After my grandmother tested positive for COVID-19 last month, I then started to present symptoms. Indeed, COVID was no longer a variety. I was now positive. I became severely ill. Fever, body pain, vomiting, sore throat, coughing. Surely, I am a survivor. And I'm here to tell the story. God was my only source of help. People are dropping like flies in this country. But I am alive. Thank God. I'm here for a reason. Be safe everyone. COVID is you. Adhere to the guidelines. Wear your mask, wash your hands, and watch your distance.